will be talking a little bit how to create value in a supply chain in general in the pharmaceutical industry, specifically about generics because I am currently with Teva, which is a generic company. So a message of segmentation, stratifications, and changing the role of supply chain within the company. Really three uh, different points. The first one is we have to understand our customers. The customers really drive the priorities for us. The second one is we need to understand our capabilities. How can we leverage those capabilities to fulfill the needs of the customers? And the third message is the role of supply chain is changing. It's no more about being the technical experts and having the best data, or at least not only about that, but it's also about how to develop the influencing skills to drive change in the organization and move the organization in this new direction. The first one is how to continue to align to a world which is changing, where the role of the generics is now becoming critical to the healthcare system around the world. Um, we are in a commodity market, in a sense, but we are becoming indispensable to the healthcare system. And striking that balance is a new challenge for the industry at large and for Teva being the largest player, uh, of course, more. The next challenge is, as you know, Teva is a balanced company between generics and innovative, and the needs of a supply chain for the two segments of the business are extremely different. So should we design segregated supply chain? Should we integrate them? That is a question that we need to find an answer for. And third, like everybody else, we're trying to figure out our strategy for the emerging markets. And given our size, that is going to be significant opportunity. Well, clearly the pressure on the healthcare system, it's increasing. So the expectations for value delivered, whether you are in the innovative or generics are changing and are, the pressure on the industry to reinvent itself is fantastic. We have seen consolidation, I believe that will continue. And over the next 12 months, probably a new dialogue with the regulatory authorities, a new agreement in principle, a new compact with the regulatory authorities in Europe, the US and around the world will have to be found because the expectations otherwise won't be able to be fulfilled. Again, the role, we all, each one of us design his or her role. So I believe the take home message for everybody who is here today, the audience today, is bring back some new ideas within your company, find the right allies and the right topics to bring those messages forward and make sure you're part of the change because otherwise you will be driven by the change.